All right, welcome back. So today I actually just wanted to include you guys on a little project I've been trying here. Um, basically, I enjoy Linux a lot and I enjoy window managers as well, um, tiling window managers and just the, the better experience that you get with that. And so basically what I attempted to do is make my Windows install as close to my Linux desktop as possible. So I'm going to show a little clip here that's going to show you my Linux desktop, which is running Gruda Linux right now, and that's with a KDE desktop. Uh, and that is using a script um, to, for the actual tiling on there, but I do have all of the same things that I tried to duplicate um, on my Windows install here. So basically I used um, start all back to put my taskbar at the top of the screen. And then um, with that, you're able to move the icons into the middle here. So it's able to put the icons in the middle like I did have on my Linux desktop. And then I have all of my controls and um, running apps, you know, over here, um, which is very standard and similar across you know different operating systems so that was very easy to do um, and then I obviously have my start menu which I can't get exactly like you know the way KDE has it but you know this is still doable and, and close to it and then I am using what's called fancy actually let me make sure I'm telling you the right thing it is actually called yeah fancy WM it you actually get us download it straight from either using Winget or straight from the store and this guy is actually pretty cool. You can change um, the different window gaps, you know, between your windows. So I can have larger gaps in my actual windows for my tiling uh, windows here. And then uh, with the interaction, you can change uh, what happens when you move windows, um, the animation. The animation was kind of clunky, so I just turned it off. It seems to be much smoother now. And then you actually can change uh, some of the key bindings to have a more traditional, you know, Linux desktop setup where you can kind of map everything. The only thing I'm missing right now, uh, which I might do um, with uh, auto key is to set up some some macros and, and key bindings for um, opening certain apps and um, closing apps and stuff like that. Because um, that's one of the things I really like about the, you know, the Linux desktop is the, the freedom to be able to, to do, you know, stuff like that. So, so yeah, so that's kind of what where I'm at right now. So yeah, if you like what you see here, definitely please like and subscribe. It helps out the channel. And if you want to see in more detail how I actually set this all up, let me know in the comments below. Let me know what kind of configurations you guys have with your Windows or your Linux desktops, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.